hello everyone so today let's see how we can create and set up the maven project in the intellij so these are the few things we will see how to do in the intellij so just open intellij so we are creating the project for the first time so click on new project so here you will get what uh, kind of project we want to create java maven gradle project okay so i will click on the maven and uh, project sdk by default it is giving 1.8 so you can uh, change it to different version if you want okay java 11 as well click on next then here i will give some name to my project let's say my app so this will be the location in the current users directory uh, in the users location so this is the group id where uh, you can have multiple artifact id linked to the one group id so i'll provide a sample group id automation dot let's say my apps and this will be my artifact id and this will be the version click on finish so within a few seconds your uh, maven project will be generated in the intel aj and uh, it is downloading some plugins for the my app so here you can find uh, the group id artifact id and version whatever you have entered while creating the maven project in the pom.xml file okay so this pom.xml file is nothing but your heart of the maven project where you can in, uh, include the dependencies different plugins you require to run the or build the maven project okay so this is how you can create the maven project so first let's see how we can add the external jars in the until ij project so just first you need to add the jar files you need to download the jar files externally from the google so from the maven repository uh, i will download some selenium jars here so for the automation we require the selenium jars so i will click on this version and here you will find the jar so i will click on that and external jar will be downloaded on your local system okay so now we need to import this jar into our maven project in the intellij so to import that jar go to file go to the project structure uh, click on libraries in the project setting click on this plus sign and here i am going to include the java so i will go to the location where our uh, jar file is available so this is the jar we have downloaded select that jar and click on ok okay so this is how you can download the external jars okay locally and you can import it in the intellij using the project setting in the project structure go to the libraries and select the location of the jar and click on add okay very simple so instead of adding the jars externally when you are uh, working on the real time projects you require hundreds of jar files okay so instead of adding those uh, downloading and adding externally we can add the dependencies for those jars in the pom.xml file okay so this is the main use of your pom.xml file just add the uh, dependency version here and it will automatically download the jar files associated with that version for the dependency so how we can do that right click on the pom.xml file and here you will find the option generate so you can click on dependency so you just need to search the dependency hit enter so i want the selenium server dependency so for the different uh, version for the dependency just expand this list and from this option you can select any one option as per your choice so i will select 3.141.59 click on add and here you can see this dependency has been added in the pom.xml file under the dependencies tag so under this dependencies tag we can have multiple dependencies now okay so this is how we can search the dependency you don't require to go to the maven repository most of the time you will find those dependency available in the intel aj uh, in the generate section itself so either you can uh, right click on the pom.xml file and click on generate or you can open the pom.xml file go to the code and again click on the generate okay so you can use the shortcut as well they have given the shortcut alt insert as well okay so this is how you can add the dependencies in the pom.xml file so next thing is we require different plugins so how you can add the plugins in the intel aj so for the maven project to run i require different plugins for example i require the test ng for my automation right so by default with the latest versions of the intel aj you will find the test ng plugin already installed already available in the intel aj still if you don't find how we can add it just go to the file then go to the settings then here you will find the plugins section 
so here we have two tabs one is marketplace where you will find the list of all the plugins available and in the install tab you will find whatever plugins are already installed in the IntelliJ so if I require testng I will search testng and it is already available and if it is not you can go to the marketplace and search the testng for example I required this plugin for creating the testng xml file so I will select that and click on install click on accept and within a few seconds that plugin will be installed in your IntelliJ so now let's see how we can add the SDK so for that purpose go to the file go to the project structure so here you will find the project settings in the platform settings you can select the SDK so here you will find the uh, different versions of the JDK available on your local system so these are the two I have already added okay for the different uh, 1.8 version this is for 3.11 and this is for 3.61 and I have Java 11 as well so I can select or I can update any SDK as well if I selected 1.8 previously I can select Java 11 and click on OK so once you add the SDK you need to set the Java compiler as well so go to the file go to settings uh, go to build execution and deployment section here you will find the compiler expand click on Java compiler so here you need to select the target bytecode version for your module of the project okay so instead of 1.5 I will select 1.8 and click on apply and okay okay so these are the different things you need to do when we create the Maven project and we need to set up all these things properly so that you will be able to add the Java classes and run the uh, test cases properly so once you added the dependencies once you added the jar files uh, you can check in the Maven section so open this Maven from the right hand side just expand your project so here you will find the different options lifecycle and plugins so once you added the dependency you just need to reload the project so click on this icon so as per our dependency it will download the jar files for the selenium server so once all the dependencies are resolved in the IntelliJ you will find this section is added in the project so you can expand it and you can find all the jar files it has fetched from the uh, Maven repository section so this is the way how we can uh, set up the Maven project in the IntelliJ so in the next session we will see uh, the different ways by which we can build and run the Maven project from the IntelliJ so thanks for watching guys, I will uh, see you in the next video soon.